Hi, welcome again. This is an intro to my performance profiling and monitoring course for Unreal Engine. So it's a free course that you can watch on YouTube and we have a companion documentation as well. You can follow through that. So without talking more about the course, let me show you some of the things we're going to do in this course. This is completely example based. So let's let's get started. First, I'm going to start this on a standalone mode. So ideally, we might do this in a launch mode by clicking here, but I'm starting with the standalone mode. Try to make things simple. Right now we have the game and then I'm going to hit the tilde key and I'm going to run some command like stat APS and stat unit. You don't need to understand all these things right now, but I'm going to go through in the, in the actual course what are these things and why they feel important. Then we are trying to understand how it's spent time on the GPUs in the profile GPU command. I'm not going to go through what this means right now, but I'll show you in the actual lesson why, how we can read these values, how we can use this information to fix if there's a problem. Also, we're going to talk about some commands like stat GPU, stat game and stat RHI. There are so many commands we can uh, drill down to understand different part of the rendering pipeline. Then we are trying to use a tool called RenderDoc to try to understand how each of these uh, frames render and we can go deeper into the each individual section level as well. Let me show you. So here there's a command called render doc capture frame. So then it will open a tool called render doc. Then this is the scene we have. Then I can open that. And then I can uh, understand where I spend time on specifically. Here we can it spend around almost 30 milliseconds. And uh, you can see the breakdown of where I spend time. So for example, right now I can see yeah, a lot of time spent on the shadow depth. And I, then I can expand that. So it seems like, um, yeah, I spend a lot of time shadow calculation for the for the grass. So then we find the problem. So this is why I spend five milliseconds over here. Likewise, you can go to the base pass. Let me find something uh, bigger value, something like this. Then I can double click on that and go to the texture view and I can see which part of the scene which has a problem. So then we, we can fix that. So all these things are basically for the GPU, uh, but uh, for the CPU side, we're gonna use a tool called uh, Unreal Insight. So let's close this first. Then I'm going to run the tool called Unreal Insights. And then I'm going to run the game again in the standalone mode. Then if you go to Unreal Insight, you can see there's a live connection. So then I can double click on that. Then I can understand the timing. So basically we can see how, how much time CPU spent timing on here. So you can see like a very, very detailed breakdown. Also we can take about the asset loading pipeline so if there's a big object so then whether it took some time to load so we can see all this information over here so this looks like complicated at first but i'm gonna show you how to understand this this is a tool comes with unreal engine by default and it's really easy to use we're not going to stop for here we're gonna try to inspect all these things on a mobile device as well let me show you some of the things we can do with that here we are trying to profile a game running on an actual Android device. So we can see some tools. For example, we can inspect the memory usage and maybe we can inspect the draw calls and find out various figures why this is slow. And there are so many things we can do with this tool. And I'm going to show you how to use this tool and, and try to understand why this game is slow on mobile device. Here we have captured a rendered profile running on an actual mobile device. So I can double click and open that. So you can see it's talk to the mobile device and get information back to this PC. Then just like in the PC game, I can see where I spend time and try to understand what's happening. Now you know what we're trying to do in this course. So let me show you what are the lessons we are trying to do and try to give some overview of the, the workflow. This is the main documentation for our course. You, you can get a link for this in the description below. These are the main lessons right now, but uh, I might change some of the things in the future. So the idea here is to not try to give you any tips on uh, improving the performance, but trying to understand why your app is slow or why it's spent time on. Then you can share those information on a forum or some other place to get help. So we're starting with the performance basics and uh, we're going to show you some of the example application we are using and like that. Then we start with GP profiling on mobile as well at the same time. Also, we're trying to use Unreal Insight tool to like do CP profiling and, and trying to see asset loading both on mobile and desktop. And then we can understand about draw, draw thread. So there's very little things we can do with the draw thread, but it's really uh, useful to understand what's happening on that thread and, and 
trying to see things and right now there's no record lessons but if you're watching this on the future but in the future if you click one of these lessons you will see a video here and also there will be a documentation on a specific point then if you need to ask a question you can use our youtube channel in a specific video all right see you soon with the course bye